In this video, I'm going to show you how to combine columns in Google Sheets. I'm going to show you five different formulas that you can use to do this, two of which will combine columns horizontally, and three of which will combine columns vertically. So let's go ahead and get started with this first example, where I'm going to show you how to combine columns horizontally by using the array formula function and the AND operator. So what we have here in columns A and B is a list of clothing items and their size. And what we want to do is combine these two columns horizontally so that both the item and the size display in one column or in a single text string. So how we're going to do that is enter our formula into cell D3 by typing equals array formula parenthesis A3 colon A. Now type an AND symbol then type a quotation mark, a space, and another quotation mark, because in this example, we want to put a space between the contents that we're combining from columns A and B. Now type another AND symbol, then type B3 colon B. Now type an ending parenthesis and press enter, and you'll see that our combined results have appeared, and we're now displaying both the item and the size in a single column or in a single text string. I'm going to show you another way to combine columns horizontally by using the array formula function and the concat function. And with this new formula, you won't be able to add a space between the contents that you're combining from columns A and B, because with the concat function, you'll only be able to combine two values, or in this example, two columns. So again, we have a list of clothing items and their size, and we want to combine columns A and B horizontally so that both the item and the size are displayed in a single text string. So how we're going to do that is enter our formula into cell D3 by typing equals array formula parenthesis. Now type C-O-N-C-A-T parenthesis to begin the concat function. Now type A3 colon A comma b3 colon b. Now type an ending parenthesis for the concat function and another ending parenthesis for the array formula function. Now press enter and you'll see that our combined results have appeared and we're now displaying the item and the size in a single text string. So now I'm going to show you how to combine columns vertically in Google Sheets, where the data from each of the ranges or the columns that you specify will be stacked on top of each other to form a single longer column. And so in this example, what we have are two different inventory lists showing clothing items. And what we want to do is combine these two lists so that all of the items are displayed in a single longer list or one single column. And so how we're going to do that is enter our formula into cell D3 by typing equals. Now type a curly bracket, which is also sometimes called a brace. Now type A3 colon A12. Now type a semicolon, and it's really important in this case that we type a semicolon and not a comma, because it's the semicolon that will allow us to vertically stack this data. Now type B3 colon B12. Now type an ending curly bracket and press enter. And now you'll see that our combined results have appeared, and we're displaying all of the items from both of the lists in columns A and B in one longer list. And you'll also notice that in this case we're displaying duplicates and any empty spaces that appeared within the ranges that we specified in the formula. In this example, we're also going to combine columns A and B vertically but this time we're going to remove the duplicates by using the unique function. And so how we're going to do this is enter our formula into cell D3 by typing equals unique parenthesis. Now type a curly bracket, then type A3 colon A12 semicolon B3 colon B12. Now type an ending curly bracket and then an ending parenthesis the unique function and then press enter. And now you'll see that our combined results have appeared and we're now displaying the items that are found in columns A and B in a single list, 
but we've removed any duplicates and we're only displaying the unique entries. In this last example, I'm going to show you one more way to combine columns vertically in Google Sheets. And with this new formula, you'll be able to keep any duplicates, but remove any empty spaces that are found in the source range. And so how we're going to do that is enter our formula into cell D3 by typing equals filter parenthesis curly bracket A3 colon A12 semicolon B3 colon B12. Now type an ending curly bracket, then type a comma. Now type LEN parenthesis curly bracket. A3 colon A12 semicolon B3 colon B12. Now type an ending curly bracket, an ending parenthesis, and one more ending parenthesis for the filter function, and press enter. And now our combined results have appeared, and we're displaying all of the items that were found from the lists in columns A and B in a single list now, and we've kept all of the duplicates, but we've removed any of the empty spaces that were found in the source range. So I hope you liked this video. If you do, please like and subscribe. And if you want to copy and paste any of the formulas that you've seen in this video into your own sheet, then I've linked the article for this video below.